How y'all doing? All right, pretty good. So what does black love mean to y'all? subject matter of it and how they kind of went to the street and interviewed couples and different people um, at this like a street festival about what black love means to them and it can it can take so many different forms right uh, romantic love platonic love familial love um, and it was just beautiful getting to hear it straight from the community themselves um, the only thing that I wish is that the audio quality was a little bit better um, the for some of the interviews the, the music was a little bit overpowering and then the the audio was low and for the outdoor scenes it was a lot of wind and stuff and and uh, i only mentioned that because i really wanted to hear what the people were saying because everything was was so meaningful and um such good quality that i i, I wish i could hear their words better but um i i thought that this was really well done i also loved the music um, throughout. I thought they made really, really great choices and um, just a great subject matter. I really appreciated that. And um, yeah, I'd love to see more from these filmmakers. Really great job. A really, really good piece. I think um, you brought together, you know, Black culture and community uh, with the very evident uh, problems and and struggles that that black people have to face on a day-to-day -day basis and have dealt with and like what does black love look like and how how is that expressed and how is that shown and how how can people um attribute to it how can like white people attribute to it um and or i guess not so much attribute to black love but like the issues that that black people face um i think it was really well done it was really nice to see um a com like communities come together um you had so many different sources pulling in for this piece you had so many different um black voices sharing and collaborating in this piece and it really just was like a it was a look at what what black people have to go through on a day-to-day -day basis but also like a look at that love that the community has for each other and i think it's just a really important story and it it's nice to see it being told, but being told in such a um, a creative and, and well done way. It's a beautiful piece. It, it really is, you know, and it's very culturally specific, but still all of us can watch this and learn something. But it's important for us to celebrate diversity and look at the specific the specific community, look at the, uh, the black community and they're discussing black love. And that's important for me to look at and know and understand, you know. And, um, and it's important for everybody to know and understand. Uh, you know, and th there's a piece of this that really, really struck me that um, really was affecting to me. And uh, it would be affecting to the black community and the, to the, the speaker and to her community in particular. But to me, generally speaking, when that lady says, um, you know, she's, she's a rapper musician, she says, we get so stuck in the business, you know, we forget to, you know, pay attention to people, basically, I'm paraphrasing, but you know, she gets, we get so obsessed with the business, we forget to love each other is basically what she's saying. And you know, and I live in Los Angeles and Hollywood, and I know everybody watching this, everybody here, we're all in the movie business, and uh, we get so bogged down and, and, you know, in our work and everything we do, we do forget to, to look at those around us and to love our friends and to love our neighbors. And so um, that was something that I really, really took away from this for myself. But, um, you know, again, recognizing that it's important for it to be, yeah, everybody can watch this, but it is important to be culturally specific here. Um, you know, it was wonderfully done, wonderfully edited, um, wonderfully paced, directed. The, the interviews um, were just wonderful. Everybody on camera was so real and genuine and amazing. Um, love the music. Um, yeah, no, this is an important message. It's a good message, and I hope it gets out there and it's gets seen. It's such a great short documentary. I really love the celebration of identity here 
and the different definitions that we get of Black love. Um, it's such a broad concept that encompasses so many different things and the film does a really good job of showing that. I liked hearing about what Black love means to different people. We get, you know, parental relationships, romantic ones, and even self-love and love of culture. Um, the inclusion of music was a really nice touch and I really appreciated those interviews. The stories were just so raw and honest. And overall, this was a really great documentary. I really liked it. Um, I really liked the music. I, you know, me, I love hip hop. I've always loved hip hop. Anytime films and documentaries, music, uh, uh, movies, whatever, short films and features, whatever, can use hip hop well, I'm always there. So I was rocking with the music. Um, also, it like touched on real issues about like black love and what that means and like the experiences that we go through as black people, you know what I'm saying? So. Uh, really powerful, really uh, important story that needed to be told told well. So, good job. I, love, I felt that it had a very poetic, lyrical feel in terms of the way that it was edited and how music was incorporated and how, although it was primarily about gathering responses and perspectives on Black love, there was a lot of observational content that the cinematographer captured. I think that aside from the direct verbal responses that were given, the impression that I got was the concept of resilience as a part of Black love, and also how Black love is expressed through artistic expression and through community and gathering. I loved how they started this with the heartbeat. I thought that that was exceedingly clever. And I also loved the drummer at the end of this short film. He was so ridiculously talented that I could have watched him a little bit longer, to be honest, because he was that good. Um, I loved the question. What this film was about, the, the premise of it, asking the question of what is black love, and then experiencing everybody's answer and experiencing the emotion behind their answers. I really enjoyed that. I really enjoyed listening to all of the different people that were being interviewed. My only issue was sometimes there was so much background noise and the, the level of the music was a little bit overpowering. So I couldn't hear what the individual's answer was. And I found myself really wanting to hear what their answer was. So I would have liked to have seen the music balanced a little bit, you know, background noise you can't really do that much about, but to balance the music with the dialogue a little bit better, that would have been very cool. Um, and yeah, I just thought that this was really interesting. I thought this was a really good on the street, talking to the people kind of piece. Um, definitely get some interesting perspective, different answers, um, a lot of cool characters involved. I just enjoyed a lot of it. My only real complaint was uh, just the the dip in the audio mix. I guess there was just times where it was uh, their voice just gets so low compared to uh, the music. It was it was hard to to kind of hear, and I just had to kind of tune in a little harder, listen a little harder, uh, turn the volume up a bit, uh, so it was manageable. Doesn't take away from the overall piece. Um, then there were just other moments where, because you know, when you're filming outside, uh, wind and all that stuff, if you don't have, you know, proper equipment, it gets uh, just, just you just get blasted. The mic gets blasted. Um, so other than like little uh, hiccups with the audio, I thought it was all pieced together really well. It was just cool to hear again the different uh, responses to the question. Uh, it was quite the variety, and uh, yeah, overall enjoyed it. Black love.